கேசர் காலேஜ் ஆஃப் ஆர்ட்ஸ் அண்ட் சயின்ஸ் ஃபார் விமன் திருச்செங்கோடு ஃபண்டமெண்டல்ஸ் ஆஃப் ரிசர்ச் மெத்தடாலஜி ப்ரெசென்டட் பை டாக்டர் எம் தனலக்ஷ்மி ஹெச்ஓடி டிபார்ட்மெண்ட் ஆஃப் அட்மினிஸ்ட்ரேஷன் ஸோ டுடே வி ஆர் கோயிங் டு டிஸ்கஸ் அபவுட் யூனிட் ஃபைவ் டு ஹாவ் அண்ட் அவுட் லுக் ரிகார்டிங் இன்டர்பிரிட்டேஷன் அண்ட் ரிப்போர்ட் ரைட்டிங் லெட் எஸ் சி வாட் இஸ் இன்டர்பிரிட்டேஷன் இன்டர்பிரிட்டேஷன் இஸ் நத்திங் பட் ட்ராயிங் இன்ஃப்ளூன்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் தி கலெக்டட் facts after an analytical or a exper- experimental study in simple if you want to say is a researcher for uh, in fact it is a search for broader meaning of research findings the task of interpretation has two major aspect that is the effort to establish continuity in research though linking the results of a given study with those of another and the establishment of some explain explore exploratory concept in one sense interpretation is concerned with relationship between the collected data partially overlapping analysis interpretation also extend beyond the data of studying to include the results of other research theory and hypothesis so interpretation is uh, it's the final stage where the researcher is going to find out the answer and he is going to make a presentation interpretation and report writing interpretation is the device through which the factors that seem to explain what has been observed by the researcher in the course of the study can be better understood and it also provides a theoretical conception which can serve as a guide for further research techniques of interpretation step step 1 explanation of relation which the researcher has found during the research study so here the researcher will give a explanation regarding the relations which he has interpreted between the variables second step interpretation of the lines of relationship in terms of underlying process here it will be denoted the underlying process third step uh, threat of uniformity that lies beneath the diversified research findings and thereby forming generalizations and theories the fourth step here the information collected during the study is considered while interpreting the final result of the research study as it may result in better understanding of the problem in hand so in the fourth step is going uh, the researcher is giving the uh, data which has been interpreted as a final result regarding the research study in the fifth step is going to consult the expert for having an uh, insight of the research study how who points out omissions and errors in a logical so in this fifth step the errors and omission will be uh, noted in a logical argumentation will result in correct interpretation and add to useful of the research result sixth step all relevant factors that means affecting the problem must be considered before forming interpretation or generalization otherwise it may lead to incorrect conclusions let us see what is research report writing research report is a systematic articulate and orderly presentation of research work in a written form research report is a research document that contain basics and important aspect of research project so re- uh, report writing research report writing is where uh, is plays a important role after you make all those investigations and interpretation you have to make it very uh, in a simple and systematic manner where everything will be represent orderly in a written form right it should contain all the basic and important aspect of the research problem which has been under gone in the research project let us see the different steps in writing report writing report can be it can be complex and time consuming process 
but when you follow the structured approach you can uh, ensure that the report is clear concise and effective we let us discuss a few steps in writing the report first thing you have to define the purpose and scope of the report second thing you have to gather data and information so in the first step you should give your objective regarding your report and the th second step you have to collect data regarding your objectives from various sources like uh, uh, books articles interview and survey it can it can be from um, primary data or a secondary data next step is analyzing the data once you collected all those uh, data now you have to go for an uh, analytical interpretation so by an analyzing the data you will be able to identify the trends patterns relationship this will help you to draw meaningful conclusions and recommendation next step outline the report structure create an outline of the report structure including the main sections sub sections and headings this will help you to organize the information and ensure that the report is easy to read and understand so outlining the report structure is very important because it gives the entire structure of your report write the report start by writing the you have to start it with the introduction and you have to provide the background information and the purpose of writing the report main body of the report it should uh, include results discussions conclusions and finally you have to give the executive summary and conclusion which should summarize the main findings and recommendation of your research report next coming to the format and and uh, present the report so it is a uh, visually appealing and easy to read choose appropriate you have to choose appropriate uh, charts wherever it is essential and tables gra graphs to represent the data and make sure they are easy to understand whatever you are going to give in the research report either it may be of a chart or a table or a graph it should be easily understood by the uh, readers because you have to indicate everything which is connected to the data here, wherever you represent the table or a chart next reviews and edit the report review review the report for you have to send the report for uh, for uh, checking the grammatical errors spellings or sp punctuations any error that should be rectified and you have to ensure that the report is well structured and the information presented everything is clear con in a conscious manner if needed to improve the overall quality of the re report so review and edit is a very important thing which you have to undertake in the report writing you have to go for grammatical errors to check the grammatical errors and the presentation how you have made finalizing the report we are coming to the final stage of report writing after you have reviewed and edited the report it's time to finalize it uh, you should give the title page table of content reference and appendix if necessary by following these steps we will be able to give a effect a uh, report that effectively communicates the findings and provides valuable report to our audience types of report writing we have certain types of reports which deals with the business academic technical feasibility progress incident and analytical report the type of report you write will depend on the purpose of the report it's important to choose the right format and style to ensure that the report is effective in communicating its message the layout of research report so now we are coming to the layout of the research uh, research report how it should be presented the first thing title page after the title page you have to give the abstract regarding your um, uh, project 
in th- 200 to 300 words which contains all the purpose methodology results conclusion a- everything next coming to the table of conduct here you have to list out all the tables which has been uh, corresponding to your report introduction here you have to give the uh, background information regarding the topic of your research problem and you have to explain the purpose of the study and importance of the study and uh, the significance of the study and the hypothesis which is which has to be investigated next coming to the literature review here you have to represent the reviews which has been given by the previous researchers regarding your current research methodology in methodology you have to design the research design sample method and data collection technique whether it may be of a primary data or secondary data and data analyze method which you have undertook, uh, undertaken in the study finally coming to the result here you have to represent the finding of the study including the data collected tables graphs or charts discussion in this discu- discussion you have to provide the findings of your result drawn to the conclusion and discuss the implications of the finding conclusion here you are going to summarize the main finding of the study exact finding of your study reference here you are going to attach all those reference which you have re- which uh, which you have referred for your report writing for example articles or uh, sources of information it may be of a web source or from a book reference whatever may be you have referred it may be given at the back next appendix the appendix section includes any additional material that supports the information in the report it may be of a raw data questionnaire or an interview transcripts next we are going to see about the norms of using chart table appendix and bibliography so chart a research paper is an article where uh, one clarifies what they have realized in the wake of investigating their subject top to bottom tables charts and diagrams are crucial and must be added nicely the various f- f- uh, norms include the title can be long or short contingent upon the discipline objective of this title heading is to improve on the table there should be a decent arrangement of segment title pertaining the per user to rapidly get a handle on the topic so here it comes the table should be represented in an orderly manner for each and every table it should be named and it should be uh, numbering should be given next appendix it refers the uh, addition behind the body of the report normally it consists of various materials the need to be included in the report but it is not an essential an integral part of the main presentation mainly the, this uh, uh, here in the appendix we used to attach the uh, derivation of equations uh, detailed calculation copies of exhibits questionnaires samples of norms Uh, tables annual reports diagrams and figures etc so this is the uh, last content of the report writing and coming to the bibliography here you are going to give the list of sources consulted as um, it will be serially numbered and the entries in it are made in a alphabetic order it will be in the sequence the list of reference occasionally a list of works on the same subject suggested for further reading is also termed as a bibliography the following are a few examples of entries as they would appear in the list of reference books with authors and essay paper presented article published journals etc